So starting this video off, today is episode 5. Also, tomorrow I'm going to be seeing Spider-Man No Way Home. So the biggest question I have going into today's episode is, will we see Vincent D'Onofrio as Kingpin returning from the Daredevil Netflix series? Now before we get started, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate that. Check out some of my other videos. In celebration of Spider-Man No Way Home releasing like tomorrow, I decided to finish the Sam Raimi trilogy, the Sam Raimi Spider-Man trilogy that is. I decided to finish it, so we have Spider-Man 1, 2, and three movie commentary slash reactions. All three of those videos are out on the channel, so go ahead and check that out. So the most notable thing to highlight from last week's episode was that Yelena showed up at the end of the episode and she's a woman of little words. She did not say a single thing. She kicked some ass, she punched some people, she kicked some people, she stunned some people, and then she just dipped. She was like, all right, I'm out. And the main theme around last week's episode was Natasha but it was more with how Clint is kind of dealing, how he dealt with Natasha's death, and also the fact that he's going to try to keep Kate Bishop safe, where she wants to be a superhero, she wants to do this life, but he knows the dangers of this life, so he's trying to push her away from this life and trying to keep her safe. The episode ended with a fallout between Kate Bishop and Clint, where he basically just told her, all right, no, we're done. We're not doing this mission anymore. We're not going on this adventure anymore go home, I'm going to do this by myself because the stakes have just gone higher because a Black Widow assassin is coming after us. So yeah, I guess let's see what episode 5 has in store for us. Ooh, beautiful scenery. 2018. Was this uh, just before the snap, maybe? Oh shit, Anna throws hands! This scene is definitely going to end with... Uh, Maybe two of them disappearing and Yelena still staying? Or maybe Yelena disappears. I'm trying to help you! Then why'd you break into my house? What? Tanya, hold her hands! Oh, they're free okay. Black Widows. I yeah. forgot about this. Look what you did to my rug. $20,000 down the drain. I don't think she was brainwashed. What, you thought I was some rich pervert's prisoner? Well, yeah, kind of. Wait, this is your house? Who is she? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention this. Forgot to mention this in the intro. Uh, be before we get anywhere in this episode, the biggest thing that I want to say is that if Yelena makes a bigger problem of this than it needs to be, I'm going to be very annoyed. Because it's a very simple explanation. The way it was set up in the at the end of Black Widow, Val came up to her and she was like, Hey, Hawkeye is responsible for your sister's death. Now, I don't know if you guys seen Endgame, but Natasha yeeted herself off the cliff. Yeah, she jumped herself despite him trying to sacrifice himself and stopping her. So Clint did not kill her. And if he explains that to Yelena and she makes a bigger problem out of it than it needs to be, then I'm going to be a little bit annoyed. I'm not going to lie to you. That's going to feel like unnecessary drama. Oh, that's so dope. Oh, that's so dope. Th Hold on, wait, I gotta replay that because I was talking. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> and she reappears back in 2023. I hope for the rest of the future of the MCU, we see at least one or two characters come back from the blip every single time. We start with contract work. And then you can stay here as long as you need. Okay, stop. It's Anna. How do you jump right back into it? Yeah, go get a job. Can you help me find Natasha? I need to tell her I'm okay. Why are you wearing your archery suit? I'm okay. This is Clint broke up with me. Mom, no. you'll be glad to know he then told me to come home and stay away from him. He broke up with me. Does Clint think you are a superhero? No, I don't either. Oh, I thought you did. It's scary now, Kate. She's gonna do it the wrong way. This doesn't have to change who you are. She's gonna put the bandage on the wrong way. It just you're so cute with that tiny bow. She's pretty good at it. Go to like the Olympics or something. <laughs> Team USA, Kate Bishop stepping up for archery. 
And I have a she did it wrong. pretty good picture of who you're becoming. Clint and I have been looking into Armand's murder. And we found a lot of incriminating stuff about Jack, Mom. She knows. She knows. She knows all of this, Kate. Promise me that you'll look into it. That's all I ask. Okay. Okay, I will. She won't. They are going for the kill. Get the show. Good catch. Hi. I know what box mac and cheese tastes like. Okay, I know it's, I know it's delicious. Ah, uh, uh, I'm gonna have to disagree with you on that. I don't have any weapons on me. Okay, I take that back. I don't have any weapons currently in my <laughs> hands. Become friends. Uh, she's trying to just be friendly with her to get the information. Oh. Hey, Grills, it's Clint. Ah, oh, Grills. Oh yeah, yeah, Where are you, Grills? Yay. We knew he would come in handy. I go. Turkey. I can put hot sauce on it. It's my first time in New York. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Go see the tree. The Empire State Building. That, that's uh, cool. The new and improved Statue of Liberty. And the Rockefeller. Pause, 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 pause. We all saw the Spider Man No Way Home trailer. I'm pretty sure they're adding like Cap's shield to the Statue of Liberty, according to the trailer. They're like doing construction on it. I'm pretty sure that's where the third act of the movie takes place. That was good. That was good. Have you ever eaten reindeer? I'm waiting Can for I her say? to flip the switch and be like, Kate, give me the fucking information. I'm done playing with you. Sometimes you're funny, Kate Bishop. Do you keep saying my whole name just to point out that you know it? Yes. <laughs> I know a lot about you. <laughs> Are you in New York to talk to Clint? Is that why you're here? No, 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 no. I'm in New York to no. kill him. I'm here to kill him. Yep. He saved the world. No. My sister saved the world. Okay, okay, you, have, you got a point there, you got a point there. You're really Natasha's sister? Yes. Wow, I did not see that coming. Like, thank God I didn't kill you up there. <laughs> <laughs> he came out here to protect me. No. He came here to protect his reputation. That's a fair, that's a fair point. The trail of blood that follows him, you could wrap around the entire world. Okay. Jeez. Wow. My sister is gone because of him. Your sister jumped off the cliff herself. Your your sister jumped off the cliff herself. Let's 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 fix that. Wait a minute. Somebody hired you to kill him. Val. There's someone out there that is telling you Clint is a bad guy, then maybe you should ask yourself what kind of person hired you. I see ticking in your head. A little bit, Yelena. However, You're not stupid. Convinced. This was a great direction. A lot of great dialogue between them two. Thank you for the girls' night. Truly. <laughs> that was fantastic. That was even better than what she did in the entire Black Widow movie. Almost forgot. Missy dropped off the new outfits for you and Kate. You know yeah! You know I do, do, just... Just not right, right now. I'm telling you, the only Sloan I've ever known was this woman I dated in Palm Beach, and she was an absolute nightmare. <clears throat> did the, did, I'm so sorry, Mom. I'm not... Did her mom turn him in? I've obviously been framed. I'll clear all this up and be back in a jiffy for your Christmas party. You'll see. On this site, it's where well during the Battle of New York, the Avengers first assembled. That's so dope. Natasha, I really need to talk to you right now. You were the bravest of us all, weren't you? Don't. Loyal. Don't start. Stubborn. You always had to win, didn't you? And for a stupid orange rock. <laughs> but I do my best every day to earn what you gave me. So I want to say I miss you. I'm so sorry for what I'm about to do. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was not the ending that I expected. What the fuck's he doing? That was great, though. Oh, Jeremy Renner is showing people how, as an actor, he was extremely... Un I mean, his character was extremely underused in the movies, but him as an actor also, how he was extremely underused. Because Jeremy Renner is a great actor. He is. He's a really good actor. Um... 
and he's finally getting to fully flex his acting skills here with a damaged Hawkeye. Pick that bow up. Let's go. We got a mission to do. This isn't over, Barton. I'm gonna find you. The mailbox is full and cannot accept any messages <laughs> at this time. Run DMC's classic tracks. Classic, right? classic. classic. <laughs> or uh, Tommy Smith. Oh, I fucking love these guys. Pull them out of your pocket in the middle of a fight. Wait one second, please. Let me put on brass knuckles so I can punch your face. <laughs> oh, shit. It's a message arrow. Maya, meet me tonight where you first met Roman. Alone. When we are not Maya. No oh, shit. <laughs> Glenn, we've been so careful, really. I, I mean, the kids and I are so far away. It's not far enough. It's just a matter of time before the big guy gets involved. Ooh, who's the big guy? I don't call looking for permission, and you don't need it from me, so. She's a great wife. Great wife of a superhero. She understands the life. Also, I saw some fan theories say that the watch, the Rolex, is potentially hers because she used to be an agent. Uh oh. Okay. Let's talk. Go to sleep. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, she can't hear any of this. Uh oh. Here's the face off we've all been waiting for. Jeez! Oh. Dope. Whoa! Whoa! This is some sick choreography. You. If you or anyone comes after me, my family, it'll be the last thing you do. Jeez, Clint. Ooh. Your boss. Wanted your father dead. Now he's using me. That Kate? Hey, Kate. Came in clutch, Kate. Who's the informant? Oh, shit. So this rescue mission? You got an escape plan? Hey, are you Tabitha? Yes. All right, hop on in. Called an Uber. <laughs> was it Kazi? Was Kazi the informant? That's how he knew who Kazi was? Oh, Talking about. Oh, because he is the only one alive. You know, I, I didn't get the call. I did not see that coming. She's on to you, bro. She said she's Natasha's sister. Surprise to him. Lena. Oh, never mind. He knows her. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, that's up to deal with. <laughs> Passing of the arrow, literally. What's going on here? What is it? Okay. Who's that with my mom? Well, that's the guy I've been worried about this whole time. Who? Kingpin. Oh! Kingpin! You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. What the fuck? That's a funny, funny thing to play. Is that him? Is that Vincent? Oh, okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it. You don't want to give us a clear image because this is before No Way Home, so you want Charlie Cox to show up in No Way Home first. And then you clear up this image, okay. And when I say I believe that's him, I'm talking about uh, it being Vincent D'Onofrio. Obviously, it's Kingpin, but who is playing Kingpin? Um, <clears throat> yeah, so they didn't want to give us a clear image. And yeah, I think I think I know why. I think they want people to go see Spider-Man first and see Charlie Cox return as Daredevil first. And then in the last episode of Hawkeye, 
we'll, we're going to get more of a clear image of Vincent D'Onofrio as Kingpin. A lot was revealed, but still they didn't give us too much. There's still a lot of mystery here at play for the last episode. Like who is, uh, like who is the informant for uh, Clint? I'm pretty sure it's Kazi. It's, it's Kazi, even though they didn't 100% confirm it it has to be Kazi uh what's happening with the whole Jack situation what's Eleanor's deal like yeah she's evil but like what's up with that I think the last episode is gonna have to be a pretty long one I'm hoping it's gonna be around an hour long because there's a lot to unpack here in the last episode plus Clint still has to get home for Christmas like will he where are we at this point is it Christmas Eve this episode is gonna need to have a lot in it to kind of bring everything to a somewhat satisfying conclusion. I'm sure some things will potentially move on to a season two, maybe, or into another movie, but you're still going to need to wrap some things up in this last sixth episode. So how are we going to do all of that? But once again, another solid episode for Hawkeye. The show just keeps going at a very, very good pace. I really loved a lot of dialogue in this episode, a lot of great character interactions, specifically that scene between Kate Bishop and um, Yelena where they were eating macaroni. That was a great interaction between them both. Florence Pugh was giving a fantastic performance. And uh, also, you know, Clint Barton and a little bit of interaction with Grills. That was nice. So I like where this show is heading so far. It's setting up for a very big, big, big finale. We'll see where it goes. I still think it's going to be a pretty long finale and give us a lot of information and show us where we're going in the future. Like, what are we, what are we going to do with Kingpin? Where is this Kingpin coming from? Is the Daredevil show from Netflix canon? Is he, like, out of prison? Oh, 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 it could make sense. The blip happens. He gets out of prison during those five years somehow, gets back to his Kingpin ways, and then maybe Daredevil comes back from the blip. Like, it does make sense, right? During the chaos of the blip, Kingpin could have got out of prison from the end of Daredevil 3. And it all could have just started working from there. Like, is the Daredevil show, are the Netflix series canon to the MCU officially? So yeah, let me know down in the comments what you thought of today's episode of Hawkeye. I would love to have a discussion with you about today's episode. Um, leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss my reaction to the final next week. Also, so you don't miss my spoiler review to Spider-Man coming in a few days. So yeah, I would really appreciate it if you subscribed. Check out some of my other videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.